you're not frightened of the dark, cause the haunted fairways of Spooky Hollow will scare the living daylights out of you. And if you happen to find yourself surrounded by ghosts, goblins, and witches, I suggest you let them play through. This is one golf course where you'll need more than just clubs and balls. You'll need a change of underwear. <laughs> Straight out of the impoverished confines of Rodeo Drive, this gated community gangster puts the rap in crap. After his debut album, Me Rap Good, sold only one copy, Ice Trey hung up his turntable and dusted off his clubs for a shot at golfing glory. Caddying for everyone's favorite trust fund thug is Ice Trey's partner in rhyme, Fresh Fruit. Here's the 10th. Oh, thank the good Lord, this is only a 199 yard par three. Cause I accidentally swallowed some tobacco juice and a turd tornado's about to blow through my trousers. Now if only I could find an outhouse. <laughs> Never mind. All right, second shot. Ice Tray has this putt to nail this one for poor. Houston, I think we have a golfer. Here goes the 11th. Check out that moon. I haven't seen a moon that big since Dolores de Podesta flashed her ass out of the driver's window of a Camry, and she was driving. I'm telling you that Amazonian has some long ass legs. Anyway, speaking of long, this 711 yard par 5 has got to be the longest hole on the planet. There are more scary twists and turns out here than the plot from a Stephen King novel. I've actually never read one of his books because quite frankly I don't like reading. My lips get tired. shot second shot Anyone got a chainsaw? Ice tray is in the rough, which believe me is definitely better than a Turkish prison. Ice tray is hoping for a birdie. No pressure. Hit it already! Congratulations! 
That putt has earned a spot in the record books. Gaze upon the 12th. These 495 yard par 4 gives me goosebumps. Why do they call them goosebumps anyway? They do not look anything like a goose. And what do they call it when a goose gets bumps? These questions have kept El Suave awake for many nights. That and why exactly does potato salad rot when you keep it in the sun? Yo, Ice Trey, those dance moves are off the hizzy. I ain't dancing. I got to piss like a mofo. Nice contact on that one. Second shot. Third shot. Ice Tray is eyeing this putt to putt for par. School must be in session because that was some textbook putting. Here's the 13. One of the reasons I really like this 400 yard par 4 is that it's really kind of creepy. You know, I'm so easily scared by stuff like horror movies, ghost stories, and outlet stores. Plus, playing at night is cool because it's not nearly as sunny out as during the day. Can't touch the kid. Trey straight fire. He's blazing. I'm praising. I ain't no liar. My man Fruit represents, because I give him 10%. 10% of nothing, jump. Second shot. Is there a doctor in the house? Because that ball's going to need some reconstructive surgery. And believe me, I've used that line before. Ice tray is concentrating to make a birdie. Nicely done! This here's the 14! No, that ain't a coyote! That's me pretending to be one! Or is that a pig? No matter none, they both squeal when you give them a tug down yonder. This 342 yard par four will also make you squeal. Tugging down yonder is optional. Yo, can a brother get a club out here? Check it, I got you a new one. Sweet! Someone robbed the pro shop. You see anything? Nah, man, can't you see I'm blind? I got to remember that one. Good shot.
second shot. Concentrate. Ice Tray has an opportunity for a shot at Birdie. Now that's what I call a stroke of genius. <laughs> Get it? To make par. One word, nice putt. Okay, so I failed math. Let that be a lesson to you kids. Stay in school. Here we are at the 15th. Thank God this is only 315 yard par four. This hole is scarier than the time I ran out of mascara and had to use my brother's crayons. But that wasn't as scary as the time I ran out of hairspray and had to use Raid. On the plus side, it did repel cockroaches. Like Danny, Marco, Frankie P, Gino, Joe. So, I finally asked Laquisha to marry. Congratulations, homie. Yeah, she just seems like a good, wholesome girl. Flexible, too. Girl got more bend than a pretzel. Say what? Uh, we took yoga together. Second shot. Third shot. Got all of that one. Ice Tray is lining up to put it in for par. Nice putt, and that's all that matters. Welcome to the 16th. This is a 374 yard par four. Now, if you don't mind, I have a story about a mamacita I met at the truck stop. I was loitering outside the ladies room. She most likely had just relieved herself when our eyes met. Next thing you know, we're doing the taco tango on the floor of the handicap stall. And they say romance is dead. Ah, nothing more relaxing than a round of golf. What was that? Don't ask, man. Where'd he go? Over there, but don't kill him. We got a tournament tomorrow. Ice Tray has a big club and is ready to jack it off the tee. Nice! Whoa, and I suppose that was intentional. Yeah, right. Second shot. Nice contact on that one. Ice Tray is ready to spank it. That's what we in the biz call a money shot. Someone tipped the fluffer.
Ice Tray is preparing to try for poor, and since I'm a pessimist, head straight for Bogeyland. Whoa! To drop this in for a scintillating bogey. Check out the 17th. Okay, this might only be a 186 yard par three, but it has this really scary drop right here. Salem golf officials have given the name of this really scary drop, the really scary drop. I think that's so creative. Club me, Whitey. Call me that again and I'll cap you. Ice Tray is going to need a shovel to dig this one out of the sand. Damn! Someone laid out some highway spikes. Third shot. Ice Tray is tapping to regain some dignity and make a bogey. This here's the 18th. Well, tweak my nipples. This 373-yard par five is a real doozy. Look at that there water hazard. Except for fishing, I'd avoid that sucker at all costs. And let me tell you, this hole's got more sand on it than a grease pig at the beach. By the way, I'm not talking about a porker. I'm talking about my woman when she slathers on that sunscreen. Now that's what I call fear rattening. Nice shot! Ow! Third shot. Fourth shot. Time to pat somebody on the back. And while you're at it, I'll take a hot old body rub. Ice tray is smacking to sink one for poor. Nice stroke, nice putt, nice job.
Last call, folks. Our winner is Ice Train. You did it, dog. Congratulations. Time to roll the credits on this game, because it's over. By the way, what the hell's a lead modeler? 